Hey guys, it's Shelly here with LoveCreeLaptopBlogspot.com. I'm here tonight to do my, finally do my Studio Calco haul. Um, my stuff just got here today, um, and it was late today. I came home from lunch at, for lunch at like 4 o'clock, and my um, order still wasn't here. So um, I went to my scrap club and I checked my um, online, you know, it, it sends you a notification when you get when it gets here, and it was like 7 p.m. when it got to my house. Um, so anyway, I'm going to do my haul. I'm excited to get my stuff because I got the October main kit, which is called Roller Rink, and then I got three of the add-on kits, and then I also got the more pattern paper. So I have a lot to show, so I will go ahead and get started. The first thing um, that kind of rolled out of my kit when I pulled out the bag is this humongous washi tape. And I know lots of people have shown their kits, but I didn't realize that it was like literally like little writing paper. It's so cute. That'll be really fun, I think, for journaling and stuff. So that's super cute. And I was so pleasantly surprised by that. When I saw it online, it, you know, from a distance, it just kind of looks like a weird stripe. And I was like, oh, I don't know. When you look at it like that, like you can use it for journaling and stuff. That's cool. I love it. So that was that. Um, I think I'm going to show the papers first. Um, so this first one I love, it's from Studio Calico, it's called Seize the Moment, um, and this is exclusive, I think, to this kit, and the back side is this fantastic gray and yellow, which is a combination that I adore, and I've been, um, kind of collecting yellow and grays together for quite some time, so I have a lot of it, but I really love this, this camera paper. I don't know about this lighting, I don't know which way's the best. Here we go again with this whole conundrum of mine. Anyway, I don't know. So that's what that looks like. It's really cute. And then the next one is another Studio Calico Tim and Beck, which I think is who used to be Sassafras, but I'm not sure. Um, it's a polka dot, kind of a lime green, yellowish polka dot. And then the back side looks like this, which is kind of interesting. I don't know that I've ever used a paper like that before. I'm going to keep them on the side that they're supposed to be on. And then this one is a Studio Calico also. It's called Plaza. I really like that pattern. Um, I like the color too. It's like a real true green. And it kind of reminds me of like a wallpapery kind of a vintage feel to it. I really like it a lot. And I love the side, that gray. But it's not like a true gray, it's kind of a taupey gray to me. So there's that one. And then there's this one from the Ready, Set, Go, Amy Tangerine, but this is a Studio Calico exclusive in the colors. Um, this color with the taupes and the black and the white, I think is the Studio Cal the one I saw at Archivers, was, it had different colors on it. And the back side, this to me looks like bubble wrap, like pop. That's what that looks like to me. You see those little bubble wrap things? Like I want to pop them. Anyway. So there's that one. And then this one. <coughs> My papers are upside down. This one is from Home Sweet Home. And it is a another Amy Tangerine Ready, Set, Go. Kind of the days of the week. And this really fun orange. I love the orange. And I really like this backside too. Which is part of the reason why I got the two, the extra um, pattern paper. And then this is a Teresa Collins paper from Vintage Vines. I really love this paper. I know a lot of people weren't crazy about it in this in this kit, but I love Teresa Collins paper. I love the feel of it. I love the weight of it. Um, I love the texture of it. And this is really pretty. So I think it's cute. And then this one from Basic Gray for Studio Calico. It's another exclusive one. It's different than anything I've ever seen before. Um, and I really like it. I think I'm going to use it probably for a background. Um, and I actually do like this side too. This really kind of funky, crazy green. I love it. And then... This one from Amy Tangerine's Ready, Set, Go. I think this is the actual one in her kit. This one's non-exclusive, I don't think. 
It's the one in her normal. And I love that orange, like, graph paper looking. That's cool. And then the cardstocks this time are Swiss dots and like a tan. A really pretty powdery blue. A white piece with like just textured, you know, regular basil. And then a gray, like a taupey gray again. So those are the papers in the main kit. And then like I said, I did get the extra more pattern papers. And that's what these are. It's basically all the pattern papers. I got two of them. Everything. Except for the cardstock. <clears throat> okay. So then it also came with these um Sotheby's, Sotheby's. That's the name of the um font. And it's printed chipboard. And I like it that it's got big I mean they're lowercase, but like it has larger ones and it has smaller ones. So I've been really kind of getting into the smaller fonts lately. But sometimes big words are not, you know, to do an act, one of the words larger would be really kind of neat and add a lot of interest, I think. So I really like that. And I love the look of the wood grain. Very cool. And then it came with some um, basic gray, I think, and designed exclusively for Studio Calico little letter stickers. One of my A's popped off. That's okay. In blue and gray, and they match that cardstock, the uh, two cardstock colors. And then it also came with this Amy Tangerine Remarks and these little puppies. I like the ampersand, little clouds, little houses, all these little cameras, that house with the little hearts. It's just so cute. I'd not, I've seen these, the colored ones at Archivers, and I picked them up one time, but I just thought, I don't know. I'm glad to have them though. And then of course our baggy o goodies with a staple in it. So it's Let's see what's in here. <clears throat> we got two little buttons or badges, I guess they're called Instagram, and then that fantastic rainbow one. I love that. And a little vintage ticket. It says White Swan Park. Here's the little stamp set. <clears throat> it's kind of an asterisk, which I think is kind of neat. Um, some of these, my mind's eye enamel dots, and I think these are um, Studio Calico. These, this color combination was made specifically for this kit, which I think is kind of cool. Um, <clears throat> and then. It comes with a couple um, previews of the Darling Deer collection. This is kind of a fun wonky, that's kind of a crazy pattern, I really like it. And I don't know how well you can see this dark one, but it has cameras on it. Okay, but that you can see it. Really cool, right? These remind me of my mind's eye, one of the, um, one of their recent, that color combination was in one of the my mind's eye collections recently. <clears throat> and there is a thing for their digital shop, but I like that because it's used for a tag. And then a perk alert thing, another little tag. And this kit was packed by Amelia. And then these are... The little vellum speech bubblies. That one's plain. A little diagonal. Little polka dots. This one says cool. Happiness. Another little zigzaggy. The arrow. And then the the green outlined one. Um, so that's that one. I might have time for one more of the little kits. This next one I have here is called Rainbow Knee Socks. 
Um, let's see if it came with this one. Is this really cute little tab poles with the star, the asterisk, and then the heart? And those are pretty good size. Cute. And um, then we got these pebbles clothespins. They look like that. And then I got a yellow, fantastic yellow washi tape, which I love of this. This might have been the reason that I ordered this kit. Crazy, right? I'm crazy. This kit was packed by Megan. Thanks, Megan. And this one came with these kind of wonky making memories, Sarah Jane, children at play alphabet. I'm not sure about that one. I think it would look kind of cute on craft though, I'm not sure. So, anyway. And then this fantastic, where does it go? American Crafts paper with the love everywhere. I love that one. That's a fantastic paper. And then pebbles, yellow. I mean, you can't go wrong with yellow. And I love these pretty little florals on the back. This one is like paper airplanes. It's Making Memory, Sarah Jane, Children at Play Paper. And Cooper make paper airplanes all the time, but I really like the rocket ship side. And then this one is Echo Park. Um, <clears throat> for the record, too, by the way, Whitlock Journaling Cards is what it's called. This red kind of polka dot pattern. And then there's the um, journal cards on the back. Life is so good. Even when you're exhausted, life is so good. Okay, and this one is Ready, Set, Go from Amy Tangerine, American Crafts. That fun, fabulous, like, multicolored. And this backside is just kind of like, that would be a nice base for a layout, I think. It's kind of, I don't know. You know what it looks like to me? <laughs> Sometimes when I do paintings, the um, bristles of the brush kind of come off in my paint and stuff, and that's what it kind of looks like to me. <laughs> and then this one, which is, what is this? Ready, set, go, American Crafts. Why, thank you, paper. The green. That's kind of fun. I really like that. The little differences in the pattern. That's kind of interesting. And the back side is this, this where it's a little, you know, corner of stuff. And that's all the papers. And then let's see what's in the little goodie bag for that. And then I'll probably do a second video with the, the other two kits. <clears throat> We've got some little Bellamy envelopes. Some more of the little My Mind's Eye enamel dots. These are the sweetest thing ones. I love that color. That is kind of a teal. I really like that one. And I like the yellow too. They're kind of fun. And then it's got these little fabric. Are they fabric or chip? I'm not sure. They look like fabric. Yep, they're fabric. Kind of like, you know, they're, they're kind of fabric y. Holla. Dude. I say dude all the time. <laughs> nerd. I say nerd all the time to you. Um, and then, lol. That's so funny, y'all. Okay, so that's all the stuff in those two kits. <clears throat> and I still have two more whole kits to go. So, um, I will probably cut this off now, and then I will be right back with my second one. Thanks, guys.